Waco, Texas. Jim, what's going on, Jim? I admire you enormously, and I totally agree with your uh, assessment out there in Los Angeles. I'd like to plant a seed, and you may or may not be willing to entertain it. Mm -hmm. But your uh, book, Culture Warrior, I haven't had a chance to read it, but I've heard you discussing it many times, uh, talks about the, the major issues, and I think that's what's at play here. That, uh, you know, it is the forces that celebrate life against forces that celebrate death. Look at jihadism and you'll see that they celebrate death. And, and uh, the same thing uh, goes here that, uh, you know, the Bible 2,000 years ago talked very specifically about the final times, the end times, and, and it's going to involve Israel, it's going to involve Armageddon, that whole region, and, and the fight is going to be between life and death. Now, well, you know, it's true, and, and it's anybody uh, who wants an interesting read, and send, uh, send Jim a copy of uh, Culture Warrior. Um, go to Revelations in the Bible and look at the prediction for the end of the world. It's fascinating. Because it does involve the Middle East, and it does involve the clash of cultures, as Jim pointed out. Now, a lot of people think that's superstition, nonsense, all of that. The secular is rejected out of hand. And, and I'm not trying to convert you to be a Bible thumper. I'm just saying it's an interesting read. This was written, what, uh, 5,000 years ago? I mean, this is real.